The ghost been hunted down. There it goes. Oh, horrifying. Welcome back, dinosaur members. It's the Talking T Rex, aka Albert Jolzy, speaking here. And welcome back to Jurassic World Evolution with the Camp Cretaceous Dinosaur DLC pack. For this episode, we are back with the showcasing park, as you can see, and we will fully showcase every skin pattern, animations, hunting, eating, drinking, and roaming, and, well, sleeping animations for the Scorpius Rex, aka E. 7 of 50 but before we get into the episode make sure to stomp a t-rex foot on that subscribe and bell button or shoot a quill at it to get notified for more of these videos thank you so much frontier for granting me early access on this now we're having that said let's go to the hatchery as we can see five scorpius rexes as we see right here maximum batch in one and we have a second one because there are multiple patterns there with uh, the rest of them now if we go to the genome library and take a look at the scorpius rex down below here if we modify the genome right there we see all the uh, skins and patterns now i pick the skin for every pattern like i do for every showcasing episode along with showcasing the scorpius rex 2015 a and b uh, skin and they will all be released in uh, this uh, showcase and enclosure as you can see to give you a better insight on which enclosure would look best for your scorpius rex while also battling bumpy the ankylosaurus which also came with of course this dlc a, a default uh, 2018 Indoraptor with a 2015 Indominus Rex skin and of course 2015 or 1993 Rexy T-Rex skin with the Parasaurus Lux glow in the dark. Uh, skin the bioluminescent one so yes let me know later on what you think of the uh scorpius rex now we're gonna start with the first pattern and then we'll we'll follow with the rest of them are you guys excited let me know all right here we go Oh, wow. The music. Oh, my word. What a horrifying beast there. Scorpius Rex number zero with the default pattern Death Valley with Rana. Look at you. Wow. Um, we don't get extra information on the Scorpius Rex, though. I guess Dr. Henry Wu doesn't really want to. <laughs> to do anything with uh, this hybrid anymore. The first created hybrid from Carnotaurus Velociraptor and T-Rex, of course. The Abomination from Camp Cretaceous. And, uh, wow, you look horrifying there. So good. Frontier did an amazing job on the model. Now, this is the base skin. It's, of course, not the skin we've seen from the show or the toys uh, for that matter. But I like these two lines that go along the head and then stop right here. We see a couple of dots uh, there and more stripes down the body like that. I like how the quills as well are colored in just like the Indoraptor uh, skins. So the quills aren't like default black always and they're also oh, so poisonous that it keeps the red eye the teeth oh it's so horrifying this is the normal walk animation it looks so good with the skinny long legs there absolute beauty beauty of a new hybrid there the first one the uh, Indominus Rex, uh, not successor, <laughs> the, the failure. I just look at you and in my eyes, it's a successor. Anyways, let's view the database um, entry we see right here. We also have the new icon, Camp Cretaceous, and that's the, uh, of course, uh, one of the 2015 uh, skins there. Description, if you want to pause it uh, yourself, uh, if you can see through my gigantic T-Rex head, <laughs> Um, feel free to do so. I'm quickly going to read through the description. Scorpius Rex is a hybrid dinosaur created by splicing the DNA of the scorpion fish, a deadly fish that secretes venom from its uh, fins with a variety of carnivorous dinosaurs. The combination of power, intelligence, dexterity, and speed was such a Powerful venom makes Scorpius Rex one of the most fearsome dinosaurs ever to have existed. It can grow up to 8 meters in length and has a rows of serrated teeth designed to tear through the flesh of its prey. Yo, 
horrifying. Oh, chills all over. Yes, the discovery of the genus was created by Dr. Henry Wu. Yes, the mad genius scientist himself under the instruction of billionaire impressor, Im impressario. Okay, there we go. <laughs> T-Rex English grammar, 65 million years of the making. Simon Masrani. Although the dinosaur's extremely uh, unstable temperament uh, led to it being placed into cryogenic storage. However, the disaster struck soon after when the storage container cracked through overheating, leading to the dinosaur escaping its unit and wreaking havoc across Camp Cretaceous. Yes. Well, spoiler a bit, but we have seen that. Um, <laughs> Scorpius Rex has uh, only ever lived in captivity. So little is known about its natural habitat. Researchers believe that the that hybrids aggressive behavior make it unsuitable for release into the wild in fact many experts believe that its creation was a mistake and it should be destroyed as a matter of urgency yeah oh. well you can try to destroy it, but um <clears throat> in the words of dr ian welcome life finds a way reproducing itself asexually as well uh, mind you so you destroy one scorpius rex and another shall take its place so there we go, that is the default one. It keeps actually the base on the belly. Absolute horrifying beauty. Absolute beauty also on the tail there. Oh, the sound effects as well. Oh, yes. I'm just waiting for that <laughs> human-like uh, roar, that monster-like roar there. The human stance, I mean, not the human roar. Humans can't roar. Last time I checked. <laughs> Anyways, ah, music kicking in. Let's release pattern number two. With a different camera view. Ah, a swamp scorpius. Absolute beauty. There we go. I actually need to name you pattern number two there. This is the mangrove forest with uh, that on the second skin. If we pause the game real quick, oh wow, green quills, they look so good though. Oh, this is such a cool skin. If you want to make a swamp for your Scorpio as well, this is the skin for to give it camouflage. Just like the Indominus Rex, it can camouflage and shoot its quills. You can't tell them apart from leaves there. Spiky uh, Christmas le <laughs> pine leaves there. Oh wow, look at you, absolute Horrifying. Let's move on to pattern number three. Mm. The Indoraptor skin. Well, colors. I love the music. There we go. Wow. Okay. I actually thought, um, because in the description, before I mention anything about the skin, I thought it would be overly aggressive. Therefore, it would have a more of an aggressive release animation. Uh, that's what I thought, but it, yeah, uh, like I said in a full showcase uh, episode, it kind of looks like it doesn't really want to be here. It's like, where am I now? The, I was on an island, and now I'm on a different island with different Scorpius Rexes of my kind, they, though I think it's not complaining. But anyways, Scarbot, of course, with our Lotho Bates, which is also the skin used for the default Indoraptor. That's why we see the yellow tones on the quills. I love that it's on the quills there. Of course, on the ah, end of the tail there, full-on black with the yellow lines. I think this is easily one of the coolest uh, uh, skin. This one's the Indoraptor Scorpius. Indo Scorpius. <laughs> Something like that. Look at you. All right, pattern number three, pattern number four being released. And sometimes I may take a little sip of the tea. Right there, I might look totally surprised sometimes. A Jeep. You did not want to be there. I like the camera zoom in. I, I love those animations when it's being released. Please, Frontier, do more of those where the camera zooms out and in. It's such a realistic touch. As if some no someone's actually, like, uh, making a documentary there. Oh my god, Scorpius Rex. Reminds me of the, the primeval uh, um, Giganotosaurus uh, airplane warehouse hangar scene. Where they're all trying to film it. And then it causes havoc, you know. And, uh, <laughs> uh, of course, rampages through the cars. They'd almost actually, uh, went through that Jeep there. That, that Jeep almost got hit by this Scorpius. But this is pattern number four there. Pattern number four for Scorpius Rex. There you have it. 
And wow, this is definitely something for the Lost World San Diego uh, Chaos Mode map. I'm not too sure now um, in Chaos Mode that you can unlock this Scorpius Rex. If it's with this skin, it suits it so well there with whitish lines, but more of a reddish and orange tones across the body. Black on top. Look at those patterns with the armor plates there a bit. Oh, beautiful. Don't, yeah, <laughs> you want to avoid those um, <laughs> spikes and uh, quills there. And there we have it. They will not fight each other because I do have that turned um, off. So, let's release pattern number five. Oh, wow. Might as well put this one in a swamp as well. Oh, the heat signature's on top. Oh, horrifying. There we go. Wow. Pattern number five. Oh, Amazon Rainforest. Yeah, this one could live with the other green one. And it's right there, actually. Oh, look at those red <laughs> toppings on the qu some of the quills. They all look. This uh, green one looks uh, much better than that one, I suppose. Wow. Awesome. With darkish blue there. It keeps the belly base a bit of a... Yeah, it goes a bit over to the... Um, not across the low jar up to the top of uh, head th there. I like how they always keep the uh, the red eye there. Uh, would be cool to also see like a green eye or something like that. But it of, of course has to keep the red eye. It's attracted to fire. So yeah, what you gotta do? Anyways, this is pattern number five and you look amazing. So that's all for this hatchery. Let's move on to this hatchery. I think these... It doesn't showcase for me. Um, maybe that will be added in the future. Wink, wink, Ludia. <laughs> no, no, Frontier. <laughs> ah, all the game companies. Yeah, so many Jurassic World games with Scorpius, Rexus. We might have Generation 2 here, Generation 3. Actually, yeah, this is the green one. This might actually be inspired of, uh, from Ludia there, from the Generation 3 one. But uh, Frontier did not uh, intend it, it, of course. But uh, you, we can actually call this between brackets Gen 3. There we go. Look at that. Now we just need an albino one, and that would be the generation two. So I'm not too sure. I think these top... No! These ones are just random. These ones are the 2015. And this is a random mystery one. So let's release this one. Although I think... Yes, I'm right. Yes, with more reddish on top there, we see that this is a cool skin pattern number six. And there you have it. And for the exact that, there it is. Yes, with the mother white we have right there. Uh, even though I thought this one was going to be the generation two. No, it kind of looks like the max level 40 skin with the red on top there from Jurassic World the game. Uh, as we see it right here, because uh, it was black all over, and then the red. Oh, yes, beautiful red modifications on the level 14 model. It kind of shows that the red is on top of here. So this is kind of a pre-level 40 skin right there. Oh, beautiful. You might as well just <laughs> put you in between brackets. There it is. Oh, wow, that's amazing. That's the roar I was waiting for. Oh, that was beautiful. Please do it again. You're not going to, are you? No, you are not. <laughs> All right, let's move on to pattern number seven, which is the final one, the blank pattern. And there we go. This one will actually show up as the logo when we release it. Though I think with my walnut size brain there, look at you, yes. Pattern number seven, the final one, and with black, of course. There we go. This looks awesome. Generation one Scorpius Rex there. Kind of looks similar already to the 2015 skins we're about to showcase in a second. Of course, full on black wheels there on top of the body. It's more of the, um, if this was more beige, it would almost look like the toy, but maybe a different kind of pattern. Um, of course, we'll uh, give you that uh, there. It looks amazing. The walk cycle looks so good already. I think they're actually going to spot. Yeah, look at that. Bit of a scare between each other. Beautiful. That's, of course, allowed. So, let's release the 2015 A skin from Camp Cretaceous. 
of the duo. And let's actually get a different kind of camera view for this one. And there it goes. Absolutely horrifying. The 2015 A skin. And you look awesome, as you can see. Right here, Scorpius Rex, 2015 A. And, oh, wow. You look great. Now, this is more of the toy colors that I just spoke of. Literally just spoke of. This is uh, kind of the black pattern almost, but it is very, a bit different uh, there, as you can see. I feel like uh, some changes have already um, also been made to the textures and stuff like that. I might be wrong on that, but I think this one actually looks uh, a bit uglier than the other ones. Maybe the tones of the actual uh, the model itself are being uh, shown more there. Even on the teeth there, look awesome. Okay, B skin, here we go. 2015 B. If only there was a C skin. Kind of want to get this from on top of there. There. Awesome. So here we have the darker, well, a bluish tone actually. 2015 B skin right there as you can uh, see there are so many scorpius rexes this one already has a dominance of 180 which uh will actually give it an advantage in battle maybe against those other uh, t-rexes and other dinosaurs it will uh, fight so let's actually use the first person mode oh i missed it oh no there it is look at that this is what it would be like oh wow you can actually <laughs> crouch there awesome so fearsome, the Scorpius Rex. Oh, wow. So this is what it would be like if you're standing next to it there. Oh, uh, some. And if we... Well, we can analyze it there. We can go to the other Scorpius Rexes, but... Look at this. Just imagine standing next to it. You're, you'll be dead. You'll be dead. Or you just have to run away there. And it's going to have a little nap, as we see right there. Oh, it looks so cute now. Oh, look at that. I just wanted to... <laughs> what a... <laughs> Head its little head on top there. It looks so cute from this angle. Look at that. You're just misunderstood. <laughs> and the next scratchies. There you go. How adorable. They're all roaring into the sky there. All regrouping. And for the final mystery uh, skin, we will have a mystery skin. I'm not too sure which one this will be though. Ooh, kind of looking similar to the Indirap skin, but more of a, well, wider color there. Awesome. Absolutely amazing. So there we have it. Uh, we might as well just call you Pattern Mystery. I wanted to call it Pattern A, but it's not. I just wanted to fill up the uh, <laughs> the empty slot in the hatchery so we could have 10 patterns. So there we go. This is like eh, another one of these skins. We've got so many in the park. They're actually regrouping. Which one's the Alpha? This one's the Alpha. Let's see the Dominus on that one before it actually goes to fight. It's got the same amount of dominance. Oh, look at that. All three of them regroup in there. This one's now sniffing on the ground on all fours. Wow. That looks amazing. Oh, you're actually drinking out of concrete. All right. I guess so. So let's check the settings uh, real quick. I'm going to put this on normal, actually. And there we go. This is on uh, off so we can actually see some eating animations. I'll remove this one real quick and replace it with a goat because we want to see that happen as well. So a goat will be joining in here along with, let's start off with Bumpy uh, right there. So we're going to move Bumpy into the enclosure and see some battles. Can Bumpy defeat all of these uh, Scorpius Rexes? I'm not too sure. I'm having my doubts here. But they're all regrouping here. We got two groups. Group A and Group B. Group A and Group B there. I'm not too sure which Scorpius Rexes are going to spar or just going to playfully play. Or all of them are going <laughs> to go after that one goat. But there are so many. You'd love to see this. All patterns next to each other with their terrifying roar. I'm just keeping an eye on the goat there. If we actually speed this up, I'm not too sure... I think this one's hunting it down. Yeah, this one's actually... No, 
I, it was just running towards the feeder. We might actually see some eating animations. And yes, it will eat. So let's see that. Oh, the gate is in the way. There we go. And the other two are joining it. Look at that. Oh, it's, um, oh, it's on all fours, just like the Interraptor. All three are eating. A glorious there. Oh, look at that fighting over the food. Of course. That's my snack. No, you stick to your side there. I like how the goat is still alive. No one's trying to uh, actually have a battle with Bumpy there that joined. They're all at the feeder now. Look at that. They're all scared of Bumpy. Except for that one. But that one doesn't notice that there's a Bumpy right here. How you doing, Bumpy? You feeling all right? Oh, look at that. <laughs> what are they all running towards, dude? They're all running. I don't know what's happening. They're like <laughs> all pack hunting. They're all pack hunting there. What they're doing? They're panicking? No, they're not doing anything at the moment there. The goat is still there. He's just running 360s. All these ones are actually fighting Scorpius Rex versus Scorpius Rex. And it's been poisoned by pattern number one. Actually, I forgot to name you pattern number one. And there we go. Um, let's see. No ghosts are being hunted. They're just turning on each other. Which is, uh, well, we don't really want to see that, but we want to see some uh, actual team up against the Scorpius Rexes. But of course, cannibalism is uh, is common with these, uh, especially with these dinosaurs, I'm assuming there. Because they even attacked each other in the um, iconic Jurassic Park Center there. So, <laughs> this one's me poisoning, it, it needs to heal up there. Uh, that one was actually fighting against it. They're, they're all keeping clear of Bumpy all on this one side. We forgot to do the tour, so let's drive the tour real quick. And check with our tour the Scorpius Rexes before they uh, battle any other dinosaurs. And uh, we have VIP access. We're going to go in first. Thank you so much. <laughs> and there we are. Let's quickly go to it. I think that's Bumpy actually going to fight the Scorpius Rex. We're going to take a quick look at that. And there we go. I think Bumpy is about to fight the Scorpius. Yes, it is. Look at that. Oh, that was a tail swipe by the Scorpius Rex. It's the 2015 B1. Who will win here? Bumpy has been poisoned. Another 360 attack. Oh, the quills. That is an instant death for Bumpy. And there it goes. I'm so sorry, Bumpy. That when I I think I even put a little bit of a modifications on there. But um yeah, it did not stand a chance. Bumpy did not stand a chance. Maybe we can um incubate another uh, a quick uh, Bumpy there. And uh let's release some other dinosaurs. I kind of do want to see the Indoraptor battle a um Scorpius Rex. So we'll just Go over and uh, look at that. Let's remove Bumpy real quick because I think there's still a goat available. Is there a goat available? Um, let's see. The goat is still there. He's just avoiding all of the dinosaurs, which is uh, very smart of the goat to do. It's still poison, but can heal up. So it should. <laughs> He's like, don't worry, I'm going to take your prize. Yeah, it's fine. I did all the work, but yeah, you just... <laughs> Pattern number four, you just enjoy that little bumpy steak. It's all good. <laughs> no worries. This Scorpius Rex, I'm not too sure what this one's doing. I think it's sniffing for the goat. It's like, I, I think I saw a goat over at this side there. The goat is over there. Okay. I'm glad I can still see the goat. I'm glad I can still see it. They're roaring off that. No, they're going to call it off. Let's uh, select a egg there. And that should be... It. Let's uh, speed this up. The goat is still coming for it. <laughs> They're about to battle. These ones are about to attack the jeep. Look at that. And uh, this one's. It looked like it was eating. But it wasn't. It wasn't. The goat is still there. The goat. How is the goat still alive? How is the goat still alive? It's running. It's running. But <laughs> maybe if I remove the feed out right there, uh, they will definitely go for the goat. I quickly wanted to see a goat kill. <laughs> Everyone in the comments cheering now for the goat there. Um, where's the Indoraptor? Uh, the Indoraptor is right here. We have the Indoraptor in here. It's roaring towards a swamp Scorpius Rex, but they're going to call it off. And, uh, oh boy. Um, yes, it's uh, it's done. So let's re-put Bumpy in here while they're actually going to battle. I need to keep an eye on There's so many Scorpius Rexes. <laughs> 
I'm looking left and right, and they are actually going to battle. Yes, Indoraptor versus Gen 3 Scorpius. Here we go, the Falling Kingdom skin Indoraptor. Who will win? A pounce by the Indoraptor. And uh, well, you might, might in the raptor, please. You you gotta avoid those quails. See, I love how the uh, the hairs as well have the pattern with it. It's got the pattern with it. Oh, it takes a tail swipe. Yeah, I think the in the raptor is poisoned now. I'm not too sure. Another pounce. Whoa! Watch out for the camera there. That was an awesome camera move. And uh, oh, I'm not too sure there. Bumpy is coming in. The Gen 3 Scorpius is uh, gonna shoot its quills at the... Yeah, the goat is still alive. It's in the background. They're gonna call it off. Scorpius is back in down. But the Indoraptor is poisoned, however. So Bumpy has rejoined. Uh, there. The goat's still alive. And we might as well just call for another dinosaur. We might as well just put the Paris Rolophuses in here as well. We've got three uh, Bioluminescent Paras. Ready to be hunted down by Scorpius Rexes. Are they actually going to have a rematch? No. He was on 45% and he was on uh, approximately 80 there. Bumpy, I think, is almost about to have a rematch. I'm not too sure. I'm not too sure. Oh, that is the goat being hunted down there. Let's see um, uh, that happening. Here we go, Scorpius Rex eating good. Oh, that was awesome. Okay, so it just grabs, it jumps on it, like, behind it to scare it. Kind of like um, a tail slam on the floor to uh, shake the ground and actually make a jump into the air. And then grabs the goat. Look at that. The goat has been hunted down. There it goes. Oh, horrifying. Goat being eaten by the Scorpius. That was horrifying. That looked awesome, though. Bumpy is still alive with the beautiful music. Yes, life finds a way. For these next battles, we need to view the Scorpius Rexes in nighttime with the new Paras, of course. And they look absolutely phenomenal. There we go. We see some sparring there happen. In the Raptor is still bleeding. Can't really heal up. So uh, let's see how this goes. I think Bumpy is about to have a fight there. Bumpy's about to fight the Pattern 3 Scorpius Rex. And yes, it definitely will. Para in the background. Let's see if Bumpy can actually win this one. Oh, yes, a shove by Bumpy there. He wants to get away from the Scorpius. Look at this. So horrifying and dark. Oh, they look so cool. Oh, and a tail swipe. Yeah, that did a lot of damage to Bumpy there. Hopefully, Bumpy can hang on. I'm not too sure. Well, Scorpius Rex looking for an opening, but that was bumpy. It's not using its club or anything. I think these are special animations. And Scorpius Rex is backing down. Look at that. Showing dominance with the power that's coming to help. And the goat. Yeah, all, <laughs> all hail the mighty goat and bumpy. There we go. <laughs> so, yes, there you have it. Now I'm just waiting for a power to be hunted down by a Scorpius. And there... I just want to see them. Oh, they actually fought each other. Okay, the Indoraptor, I saw that. It was quickly being taken down. I couldn't see the Indoraptor. It looked like a Scorpius Rex. But, um, of course, if you want to see a real killing animation, I do have a Battle Royale video planned between all of the hybrids. So, yes, uh, go check out that video um, uh, after the showcase in episode this one, of course. So we've got some paras. Oh, it actually ran out of stamina, I think. No, it is hunting down a para. Oh, and it missed it. Even though this para is, um, wow. Okay. There he goes. And it pounces it. Scorpius Rex taking down the para. And that is another one down there. It took a while. That one was uh, really asking for its death there. <laughs> <laughs> so let's call in some other dinosaurs. Um, let's call in the Indominus Rex there. Low health. We have one low health warning. That's bumpy. Um, it can't really heal up. No. No. Can't really heal up because um, I don't think it has enough. Uh, even though these are all the requirement plants. The Scorpius Rex is taking a quick snack of the Bioluminescent Para. And let's actually speed uh, that up. Oh, we see some para being hunted down there. 
Oh, a roaring on all fours, intimidation roar. The pirate is fleeing. The pirate is fleeing. That one's casually eating something. I'm not too sure what it was eating there. I think it's eating the goat. Now you're just casually sitting. Look at that. Waiting for your inevitable death there. So this Indoraptor sadly did get taken out by this Scorpius Rex. I think it was the Generation 3 one. So yes, Indominus Rex will be joining us. And there we go. Touchdown the 2015 Indominus Rex has joined in. And now Dr. Henry Wu is like, let me show you what this hybrid is made out of. <laughs> the real successor, the real deal, what I uh, <laughs> intended to make. So, oh, this Scorpius Rex is having an eye on the bumpy that's trying to hide with the trees there. 31 and a level, uh, no, not a level 100, but a uh, 100% health uh, Scorpius Rex. Will be uh, t yeah, yeah, it's gonna take it down real fast. It's gonna take it down. There it is And there it goes. That's what should have happened in the season uh, if, uh, if realistically speaking, I didn't want but the bumpy to die. Don't worry <laughs> Even though I'm a t-rex and I do would like to know what a bumpy would taste like uh, eh, <laughs> I do not want bumpy to die. Anyways, here we see a battle between Scorpius Rex and and Indominus there. Oh, look at that. All running together. A snap by Indominus there. They're, they're all praying for the score. <laughs> what is happening? They're all running, trying to distract the Indominus. <laughs> Scorpius Rex still backs down, though. Indominus Rex showing its might. <sighs> Magnificent. What's been taken out there? Oh, they're finding each other. That's what was happening. Okay. Let's uh, get the uh, let's get Rexy in here as well and change it back to day and speed up the time a bit. Ah, open up the eyes again, and there we are. So we do have a couple of Scorpius Rexes that are on low health. So yes, we've seen um, so far it eating against uh, well, it's eating other dinosaurs, the feeder, the goats, the hunting down animation, the roar, the idol, the sleeping that and the Indominus Rex is just even more aggressive th than the Scorpius Rex is just taking down all the Paris for the Scorpius Rex is actually helping it. Rexy has joined in to battle of course the Scorpius Rex as well. And there we have it, Scorpius Rex versus T-Rex. Rexy taking a snap at the level 40 Scorpius Rex we see right here. And uh, oh, they're getting close there. Another quill attack, quill impact by the Scorpius Rex that does a lot of damage to the T-Rex. Can it hang on though? It reacts with a snap. The raw power is not to be uh, underestimated there. Scorpius Rex knows that. Look at that awesome stats there with the raw. The oh, it's just snacking on the power of that. Oh, it's healing up. Oh, what a strategy! It retreated to the bioluminescent power of Now, the Rexy is actually being smart as well, and it's actually going to oh, it actually died by Indoraptor. There, it actually got defeated by one of them. Pattern number one I thought the uh, the dinosaur that the Scorpius Rexes are battling are too weak, but apparently, Indoraptor actually took down a Scorpius in the background, which is a uh, very uh, good thing, or Indominus. Is that in? No, it's Indominus. <laughs> That's Indom. No, it's Indominus. It wasn't in the Raptor. It was Indominance. Okay. Well, I did not expect that. Actually, 33, 18. I think they're uh, both gonna go down there. Rexy is healing. Even though it ate, it got driven away by this uh, duo, Scorpius Rex. There, and I think that's not gonna be it. Um, this Indominus Rex is challenging the mystery pattern. I think that's game over for the Indominus. And there it goes, a quick snap going down. It looks so, it doesn't really, it's not really that aggressive. Scorpius Rex is like a slight touch. It's not like, <laughs> going all over the place. No, it's just calmly taking them down. I think Rex is about to uh, go down as well. Yep. There it goes. Oh, neck 
twisted though. Yeah, that, that ought to do it. That's the final one. They've all been taken out. Dr. Henry Wu is like, yo, um, what are you doing with my good dinosaurs and good hybrids? All the Scorpius Rexes, I love the icon as well, um, are uh, left there. The only thing that we now need to do is uh, have a little bit of a breakout because I do want to see a havoc across uh, Jurassic World there. We've got some guests left. And uh, if we put a uh, um, Scorpius Rex out there, I do want to see some human hunting there, of course, which would look amazing. So I'm just kind of waiting for Scorpius. The, the goat is still available, or that's a new goat. I, I doubt it was the first goat we've seen. <laughs> so let's actually speed this up real quick. I like how I almost have five stars there. Look at that. Yeah. <laughs> it's about to become one. This Scorpius, the mystery pattern. He's making his way towards the gate, actually. Look at that. When it's sped up, it looks so happy. Strolls into the... Oh, watch out, Jeep. That Jeep drives recklessly. Doesn't care about any of the dinosaurs or in it. Or it's going back. No, the other Scorpius Rexes are uh, go coming here as well. When, it's, when one starts to run, then you know it's going to hunt down a human. All the humans are panicking over on this side there. They're all walking now. Let's uh, keep a close eye on that. Right, uh, uh, this one's <laughs> casually sleeping. This one's just leaving the island. <laughs> He's like, I gotta get to Isla Sauna. They need me. <laughs> I ain't got time to eat humans. So, wow, look at all those humans there. I, it, I think it doesn't have that much sta uh, stamina, actually. All of them are just casually walking there. They don't really want to do anything. And uh, they're not done hunting down the humans. It's not after the campus. All the candles, look at that, all in the corner there. What are you going to do? It's going to sleep. <laughs> it's going to study them. Now's their chance to run. Oh, wow. Really, How? what's the tactic? They all escape and then immediately go to sleep. This is not canon. <laughs> but now they're all in a pace of just casually roaming and exploring. This one isn't even a danger to guess. Yeah, they're expanding their territory. They don't care. They're in a group. They want to take over the island. They just only care about the dinosaurs, not even humans. I might actually need to try something. Now they don't have anywhere to go. Please fix faster. There we go. Scorpius Rex can't escape now with the humans. That's right. It's, go it's going back. It really doesn't want to go for the humans there. And now it's boxed in. So now you can't do anything. Oh, well, you might actually try to uh, break the fence. We would also see a kind of an animation of that happening. Because now it's boxed uh, in, and uh, I think you need a bigger space. Or this is a decent enclosure. The humans disappeared! Whoa! They have Scorpius Rex teleportation and camouflage powers. They're gone! <laughs> They're, they just left! What's happening? They just left! Is it hunting down? Oh, yes. Oh, this one is definitely... Oh, which one is it hunting down, though? Scorpius Rex is hunting down the humans! Let's see which one's actually going to grab. Oh, it's going to grab that one, and there it is. Oh, my words. Wow. That was terrifying. Thank you, Frontier. <laughs> oh, now I have the telephone. This, <laughs> this line's like, yeah, this is calm. This is what I see every day. <laughs> Um, all right, well, the Scorpius, I think you have a phone call there. You might want to pick it up and clean up the bodies you left behind. You might want to pick it up, and I think that's the ringtone for me to end this video here. That's the full showcase of the Scorpius Rex in Jurassic World Evolution 2. Let me know what you think of the Scorpius Rex and the DLC in general down below. Do you guys think Frontier did an amazing job on the Scorpius Rex model? I think they did. It looks amazing and so accurate. So yeah, horrifying yet so beautiful and deadly. So yes, let me know and make sure to shoot a quit on that subscribe and bell button if you want to get notified for more of these videos. Now I hope all of you lovely Camp Cretaceous members are going to have a great day and I see all you lovely E750s in the next episode. Goodbye Scorpius Rexes, the talking T-Rex, out.